Good morning, everybody. It is a Monday. I'm calling it a musical Monday because just for you, he is back. Grammy winner Miguel is going to perform in a BT exclusive. Super hot track called Coffee, and that is some spiking hot, hot latte. <laughs> How was your weekend? Yeah. How are you feeling, Mel? I'm feeling so much better. You can still sense a bit of a clogginess in my voice, but I'm so much better. I spent, unfortunately, the best weekend weather-wise in know. bed, but that's okay. Yeah, yes, you guys had fun. It was a spectacular weekend. I saw you on Instagram that you were enjoying a little rooftop pizza. <laughs> I did a little rooftop pizza with some good friends, with Jonah yeah. Daniel. Shout out to them. They watch our show. And uh, I had a nice picnic, Puglia's a potluck picnic style. I am so carved out. Please, no questions. It is a car belly that I'm sporting in this super tight dress today, extra tight. Don't and you find like, weekend? Don't you find like with summer, it's the time of year where you're, you feel like you should be feeling the thin. Yes, uh, but it's not but, happening. But no. It's not happening because there's so many barbecues, there's so many events, there's so Showers many things. And you got, weddings. You're like, I gotta live. You just I gotta accept live. So I gotta eat. It. I gotta live. So I was just sitting yeah. in the makeup room because we have Oprah's, well, when the Oprah show was on, she was one of the um, producers on the show. She's mm. back with the 10 greatest gifts for moms. And we were talking about Spanx. And I'm like, listen, that's why Spanx was invented. And right. she was telling me star secrets that in Hollywood they'll wear like double Spanx Whoa. and saran wrap. On top of the Spanx? I said, I need to know the process. Do you put on two Spanx at a time? It's hot do you do there, one isn't it? It's that's hot and it I hurts. Said. It hurts. It's painful. And what happens if they have to rush to go to the bathroom? Like, you need five it'll people be like to wrap you. you. It'll be like you all over again <laughs> from the, the other day. Game? Yeah. I got a yeah. bad bruise from that. Anyway, <laughs> we're so proud and thrilled for our Tracy Moore. Mm -hmm. We know and love her, the hostess with the Moses on City Line. Mm -hmm. And she had the honor of not only running with one of the Pan Am torches, but actually watching Watch it. Lighting this. the cauldron at Parliament and Bayview. This is the best Amazing. reaction. She'll back up. Woo! Because you never know, Watch right? Watch yeah. that flame. This was a really cool ceremony the entire run um, because a lot of people are not only talking about the run and lighting of the cauldron, which Tracy did an amazing so cool. job, but the Bloor Viaduct, the lighting of the luminous veil, it's been years in the making. Okay, mm. look at this. Basically an art installation. 35,000 wow. LED lights strung across the safety barrier mm -hmm. so everybody will be able to enjoy this. Get this. All year long. It's been, oh, wow. yeah, absolute years in the making. And what's cool is that it changed the colors with wind as well as the season. And it's going to be a lasting legacy because once the Pan Am's gone, this will stay lit up year round. Well, and that's the thing. We hear so many gripes about the Pan Am and the inconveniences with traffic. And, you know, there's been a lot going on construction wise. Well, but they're, they're, the they're, infrastructure yeah, they're yeah. building is going to be here for us to enjoy mm -hmm. forever. Well, you yeah. think about Union Station and whether or not you like it, the Up Express, which is convenient for a lot of business mm. travelers. Harbor Front. Harbor front, they've, yeah. they've you know, changed the look of Queen's what Key. A lot, of, front? A lot has happened. The whole uh, area has been redone and uh, mm -hmm. kind of widened, and there's been mm -hmm. more areas for pedestrians to walk through. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Are we yeah. there Friday, Paul? <gasps> Good. We'll see it for ourselves and bring it to you Friday. We actually yeah. are going live with the show there to celebrate all things Pan Am. Yeah. Which is great. It'll be exciting. And Jen's at Union Station. We're oh, talking yeah. about Union and, and just pedestrian traffic. It's so much wider. You feel like, have you been down on the platforms? No, but it looks so pristine. It looks clean. clean. And and pristine. pristine. Um, Look at this. It's so inviting. You just want to sit food there. Market, which is fantastic. So, mm -hmm. oh, so they have local vendors. They have. Local is it like foods. Fresh Farmers Market? Yeah, and they're having the the, the, the cheesecake guy. Just Uncle over Tetsu. The oh, oh, oh my! Tetsu. Like I drive by that every day. Your dad's and, there. No. 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 The, this one. So no. But I, that that uh, cheesecake. Um, mm. Their lineups are yeah. unbelievable. I know the Winston went there. <laughs> several. Yeah. I think it was a couple. He opened one next door. And that was a couple months ago that you he went. He opened up a store next door? They opened up what they call a matcha cafe where you can get like ice cream and coffee and all that. So now there's another Uncle Tetsu's right next door. And is there a lineup Crazy. for that one too? There is. A, it. It's a much smaller lineup. People still yeah. go for the, the legacy product. They're, they're we hero tried product, it the here cheesecake. on the show and I think it's one of those acquired tastes. It is. It's a very unique flavor, but mm -hmm. people will line up hours and hours for it. Amber's lying. She's right like, there. code for it. You didn't like it. <laughs> no, listen. <laughs> no, you're, it's Here's the thing. It's called a cheesecake, so you expect cheesecake texture. You expect right. layers of graham crumbs, and it's not that. A different taste. A different it's taste. It's more of like yeah. a Speaking of cheese, I had some wonderful buffalo mozzarella over the weekend. Oh, with some tomato, a little oh, basil. Oh, yeah, a little basil, Why tomato, didn't you bring in to share? Oil. That there is love. <sighs> why, why, yeah, why no sharing? Why no sharing? It's, it's gone. Gone. It's gone. Gavin ate it all, my son. Blame it on the kids. Now we're Good Monday morning, everybody. <laughs> About that news. 7 o'clock. It's happening.